Hi, this is Gary Lee Stanley, your sales guy. Hey guys, hey. Hey, we're gonna talk about my favorite subject today, which is sales. All right. Our subject for today, which is really, really gonna be entertaining and cool, is just for you. Here it goes, sales guys and ladies. Uh, don't over complicate yourselves. Okay? Uh, don't over complicate yourselves. What in the world? Okay, we'll figure that one out. Listen, a lot of times, even in my own experience, I have made something that was so simple, complicated. It's the truth. I've been in sales for a long time. So a lot of times when you are trying to sell something, you got this little bit of fear because you're afraid to ask for the order. Maybe you want to close, but you haven't, you know, you haven't got to that point, but you're feeling a little not yourself. Well, as a salesperson, we just got to deal with reality. Life is going to throw us some curves and we're going to have some issues and we're going to have to, you know, make things simple for our customers. We don't have to be so complex when we're trying to sell our customers. We just need to make it simple for them. Keep it simple. The KISS method. And in this regard, the KISS method also, it's for some people, it call, they call it keep it simple stupid, but I call it keep it simple smart person. And when you're trying to make a presentation and you go on and on and on, people get this glazed look over their eyes and after a while they just are turned you off because they don't even have a clue what you're talking about and so what happens is is you lose a sale and you bore people and the next person that comes behind you they're gonna have a harder time getting in there so as a salesperson we learned that we need to continuously keep on training. We, the more we learn, the better we'll be at our, our presentations. The more opportunities we get in front of the customer, the better we'll become. But remember, you need good, good training. <laughs> it's just that simple. You know, my name is Gary Lee Stanley. You know, I've been in sales and I love everything about it. It's like my favorite thing to talk about. You know, you don't want to uh, put yourself in a situation where you got a customer right in front of you, an older person. It could be somebody who's got no technical background and everything, and then you vomit your presentation all over them. And I'm going to tell you what, there's a lot of consumers out there that are, they know a lot about technology and stuff, but there's still a broad amount of people that are baby boomers that ha they're, they're still behind in their technology and some of them don't even want to learn it that's just the truth so we have to take that in reality so when you're having a, a, a conversation with your customers you can't act like you know uh, I don't know somebody told me a long time ago I, you should talk to people at a, a at a seventh grade level and I'm not going to say that's to be rude or anything but if you're doing any more than that you're probably being too technical being um, a person who just comes across as arrogant and some person and some people they they don't like that what people want to do is just have a simple conversation and if we start you know you know com, com, thinking making things difficult throwing our big words around and those things that you know we know in the industry and so forth you got to be real careful when you're talking with clients because they're important and they matter because you know they help us make the world go around because we're salespeople. I love my job. I love selling sales. This is what I love to do. But if you are a, a new salesperson, enjoy the ride. Take your time. Even if you've been in this for a long time, enjoy the rest of your career because this is a great opportunity. This is an opportunity that you can make your own way, your own money. It's strictly mostly commission. If you get a little bit of a salary, that's good, but I like, you know, commission, straight commission, because what happens is, is I get to dictate what I do and how much money I can make. And if you're an entrepreneur, that's what you want to be able to do. You know, not to compliment, you know, just make this complicated. I'm, I'm, <laughs> isn't that funny? I don't want to make this complicated, but let's make this real simple. Learn the features and the benefits of your products have a process to be able to present your product. You want to have a script, hopefully something that's been given to you that you can start from A, B to C in a, 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 in a way that you'll introduce yourself. You'll go in there and you'll have a conversation with the customer and then you'll ask for the order. 
we really want to make it complicated. Now, listen, if we can create a value more than what it's going to cost the, the client in the long run, it's going to be a sell. So you have to remember that. Keep it simple. Smart person. That's what we are. You know, my name is Gary Lee Stanley. Just throwing out some ideas and some things that may want to make you think. Because as salespeople, we are very inquisitive. We want to know things. We want to be able to close in different, different ways. And I'm going to tell you what. If you got a sales toolbox, you know, that's just a, an idea. It's just, it's not, it's, it's in your mind kind of toolbox. It's the things that you want to be able to sell in a, in a way, but with having tools that you've learned, those closing methods, those ways to be able to have a conversation with a customer instead of talking down to them, you're going to be way ahead of the game. And I'm proud of you because you're a great salesperson. We really are great salespeople. We just have to grab a hold of the bull by the horn. We got to grab a hold of those, those mentors, not people that are manipulators. Dude, I've got a mentor in my life right now that's about one of the most honest person I've ever seen. And, and he and, and boy, you know, some people, they call it snaking. They snake people. Well, this guy ain't that guy. And I'm impressed. So, you know, I have to step up my game. And I just like to say, you know, honesty is the best policy, especially in your sales. You don't have to take advantage of people because in the long run, it won't work out because your credibility and your branding name is so valuable. So if I don't want to, you know, listen, guys, when you have a customer in front of you, you've given them your presentation. It is your duty to ask for the order. So don't forget to do that. But you have to follow your process, the thing that makes you be able to close. You pull from different pieces. This is what I'm being taught even now. And then you construct something that is going to be able to work with multiple types of customers. You got this? And my name is Gary Lee. We're just having a good conversation. You know, our subject for today is don't complicate your sales. Really, I'm serious. Customers want to own stuff. They want to buy stuff. We just don't want to make it complicated where they can't get stuff. So let's go ahead and sell something today. Do me a favor. Let's go out there and just have a good attitude. Hey, guys, if you like this video, if you, you know, think that you have some ideas you'd like to share with us, I'd love to have that because I do have a good forum here. And we hope that you will not make <laughs> yourself so complicated because you got this. Me too. I got to remember to do the same thing. You don't tell me to do something and then you don't do it. So I'm going to go out there and sell something today. I'm going to try and I'm really, really going to try not to complicate things. <laughs> Let me go sell something. Bye-bye.